Hi, it's been a while since you've heard from us here at Active, so here is a new quick update video for you. So just in case you were wondering, the noise behind these doors is coming from the new Active 2.0 that we are currently developing and that will be coming out soon. Let's check it out. So again, this unit has been running for more than two hours at this point, non-stop. And here are the results that we're getting from it. So since we've been gone here on social media, our engineering team here at Active Products have been working hard to improve the pump and the motor on this Active 2.0 to achieve double the life cycle than the VE52. So we're so excited to bring this out to you guys and have it out in your garages to use in your cars. And at this moment, we're still in the process of making new content for this unit. And once it's all done, we'll be back. And thank you for being patient and thank you for sticking around and supporting active products. Hey guys, so just a quick update on the active 2.0 life expectancy testing that we're doing. So far, the unit has been running for six hours straight, nonstop. We haven't turned it off, we haven't touched it since we started the test at 9 a.m. and it's now 3.15 p.m. The unit is running good and strong, no showing signs of malfunction whatsoever, and here are the results. So there's still no sign of dropping of the GPM, the PSI, and the voltage for six hours. So that is looking pretty good in terms of specs. In terms of the unit itself, the 2.0 is still going pretty strong. No cracks in the pump, no leaks inside or outside of the pressure washer. In terms of temperature though, it's gotten hotter considering the amount of time that it's been running non-stop and it's still not close to the point of overheating at all. We're so excited to show you guys the results and we will keep you updated. Hey guys, so it's been eight hours since we started this 2.0 test. Now we've reached the end of day one. It's 5 p.m. so that means the active 2.0 has been running for eight hours consecutively non-stop. So, so far the unit is still good. Still no signs of any malfunction or leaks. And here is the result from the testing station. Stay tuned and we will see you in the next update. update.